Hi, this is Brett Lee and you're watching CATV. So Stuart, did Tim and Troy lose a bet? What was going on there this morning? No, no, bet's lost uh, in the serious business of Test Cricket. We um, just took a bit of an opportunity to lighten things up a bit and we're fairly uh, monotonous and, and fairly structured with our warm-ups in general, so look, just for, for a bit of a laugh and um, lighten the mood a little bit, we thought we'd, we'd change up our warm-ups. Coach Tim. is always the easy target, isn't he? Hey, take the mickey out of the coach. Yeah, no worries. Well, how'd you let it happen, coach? I didn't have much to do with it, actually. I just do what the warm-ups, what I'm told to do in the warm-up. Carfsey said it'd be pretty good fun. Um, once I heard what he was thinking, I made sure we padded up pretty well. But I also knew they'd be, they'd be wanting to throw the the, uh, the vortex at Troy more than me. So I took that as a, as a positive. Upset you didn't pack your spikes because you slipped over a few times there and was it left prone on the ground? No, I didn't slip over too often. I was actually diving for cover and cacking my pants. So uh, no, it wasn't about slipping over. I was just trying to get a big hole and get out of the way. So a regular part of the warm-ups, Carfs? Don't know. I think, given the, the difference in the size of the two, that Cooley's a much bigger target. I don't think he'll be too uh, keen to keep it going. I think uh, Vinny's got a bit more uh, agility and mobility about him. He can. Uh, I think he certainly came off. Um, Tro Troy certainly came off second best. Looking forward to more of it. Bring it on. Thanks, guys.